So I like this girl, and I want to get to know her. But I don't want to stalk her. I want to get to know everything about her without sifting through page by page. This is how you do it. Nicole's got here for Netbook News, and here we have something a little special for you. I have a shirt, and it says, 3D, I want my money back. But today, I'm going to take back that statement, because you can't actually tell in this video how 3D or no glasses 3D this actually is, but what you can tell from what I'm showing you is that the viewing angles on this are incredibly deep. So even though this is no glasses 3D, out of the um, 10 degrees viewing cone in the center that is 3, 3D, um, outside of that you actually get like amazingly clear video with just awesome viewing angles. Like what is that? That's unbelievable, you can still see the screen. So anyways, how, how this works is um, Actually, I'm going to get Roy to explain it to me. Roy? Yep. Take it away. Explain exactly how this works. Okay, we recreate the same effect as closing the left and the right eye to give you a 3D image. And instead of closing your eyes or making you wear glasses, we have a barrier on top of the uh, LCD. We have another uh, LCD made out of slightly different material called TN LCD. And we apply electrical charge to that barrier, which has the same effect is blocking the image between the left and the right eye. And we do that using a patented uh, invention we have, which is using cells instead of stripes to create that blocking of the left and the right image. And the cells are very, very fine, and the gap between the cells lets light through, so that even when you don't have the 3D image, you still can see the, uh, the 2D image. And that viewing angle is, uh, is very popular, because you can't always see a 3D, but you can always see the movie or the game. Well, I know you guys can't actually tell that the 3D is working and like when we're dead center, but at least you can tell that you can actually watch a 2D movie on a 3D screen. So this has been Nicole for Netbook News, taking a look at what's coming on next on a smartphone and a tablet near you.